All right, everyone, this is Zero Budget Geek, and welcome back to Zero Budget Hearthstone. In this series, I am building level one decks. Uh, that is decks that you can build right from level one with the cards that you have. You don't have to unlock anything else. Today, we're going to cover a level one warrior deck. Let's see how this deck is put together. Alright, so here we have the level 1 warrior deck. If you want to see the full deck list, you can uh, get it down in the description box. But I'm going to go through the cards very uh, very quickly. So, uh, one of the first cards that we see here is the execute card, which destroys a, a damaged enemy minion. Now, that can be used in many situations where, you know, after a fight, you can uh, just uh, finish off a guy. But it works especially well with the elven archer, because the elven archer does 1 damage when it comes into play to a creature. And then you can finish it off with execute and you can also use that with the storm pike commando can also do the same thing um, and again you know the elven archer uh, as a 1-1 one -one is not that great but it's a battle cry is what makes it uh, make the cut in this deck then we have the fire war axe which is uh, pretty good uh, as a starter weapon it does uh, three attacks so it's uh, good uh, for uh, some removal get rid of uh, some pesky creatures that come out at the beginning and then you also have the heroic strike now, uh, combined with the Fire Ore Axe, you can get uh, some gr great damage with that, but it's also useful when you don't draw your Fire Ore Axe uh, for some removal. We have, as usual, the Acidic Swampoos, that is a good attack and health for its cost, and if your opponent does have a weapon, it's just even better. Then we have uh, the Iron Ford Rifleman, which uh, basically works well with the Execute. Uh, we have the Shattered Sun Cleric, uh, again, just a great uh, starter minion, gives you a, a friendly minion 1-1. One, one. And the Warsong Commander is really awesome where you put it down and all your minions of 3 or less attack gain a charge. Uh, Chilwin Yeti, again, great uh creature for its cost. Gnomish Inventor is just here uh, as a, you know, just for its battle cry where it lets you draw a card. Uh, you don't really need to protect many cards here, but the Ascension Shieldmaster is always uh, just a good addition. We have the Frostwolf Warlord, which, you know, just guy gets pretty big pretty fast. Uh, the Gurubashi Berserker is really great. It also works with the, uh, it works with the Elven Archer and any of your other guys like the Stormpike Commando these guys that do damage you can use them to do the damage on the berserker and give him his uh, plus three attack and then we have the boldest fist ogre which is just a great uh, creature for its cause and last but not least the usual storm wind champion so let's see this deck in action Garrosh versus Jaina you asked for it all right so here we are facing off against a mage uh, not a bad start. We really don't need this Frostwolf Warlord yet, so we're gonna uh, put him away, and uh, we'll keep the other two. Those are those are pretty nice. And let's see what we draw. The Shield Master. Well, that's pretty good. That's not a bad start. Okay, so we will start her off. We got. Oh, that's nice. We have an execute. So now I kind of want to hold on to this Elven Archer to use with the execute. So we're gonna actually not do anything right now and end the turn. Let's see what the mage does. So the mage is probably going to try to play a controlling type game. So now we have two. Uh, since it's a mage, we know she's not going to play a weapon. So we'll throw out this acidic uh, swamp ooze. And we'll end the turn there. And uh, should be able to attack with that next turn. Uh, he got that. Let's see. I could... I could play the elven archer... Actually, I could kill it with uh, this uh, sword. Uh, we can... Uh, hmm. Three mana. What would I do with that? I could play both of these and kill them. Well, let's go ahead and do that. We'll play the Elven Archer. One shot, one kill. We'll damage that guy. And then we'll play the Execute to kill that. And then we'll attack to the face. And end the turn. So we want to uh, control the damage tempo here. We want to try to attack quickly and often. Like we don't want to give the mage chance to, you know, uh, get set with some good spells. We want to, you know, try to take her down as early as possible. Okay, so we got. Uh, let's see here. 
Actually, this is kind of nice. We'll go with the Sunjin Shield Master. Yeah, we'll do that. So now these guys have to attack this, and then we're just gonna go straight to her face. I'll give it a shot. And then her turn. So she can probably spend some man, uh, some mana here to kill this with a fireball, but uh, that would mean she's not spending our mana on any other things. All right, and that's why I put the the Senji Shield Master to. She basically got rid of her own creatures herself. Okay, uh, we do have a heroic strike. Uh, do I want to use that right now? Um, uh, not really. I can use this to kill that and then attack to the face. So we will use this to kill that. Attack to the face and then we'll put this chill win yeti. And then return there. That's not going to help him that much. Oh, that guy's pretty big. So that's why I uh, definitely saved this heroic strike. Because now this guy's got a lot of health. Uh, how do we want to do this? We have six. We could put a Boulder Fist Ogre. Uh, but I want to get rid of this big guy here. So I can attack for... Uh, th well, my Swamp Ooze is going to be dying. So we're going to do the... Play the heroic strike, and we will attack the, with the acidic swamp bulls. We'll attack ourselves. I'll put out another chill win yeti, and then I'll attack uh, her with my chill win yeti and end the turn. He puts another one of those. All right, he's gonna blast that guy. That's fine. Okay, so now, oh, actually, yeah, so we're going to do the, I was thinking of doing, uh, oh no, I was thinking of doing this guy to give a bonus, but I like putting this guy now, he'll get plus two, plus two, and I'll be able to armor up. Yeah, I think I want to do that, uh, yeah, we'll do that. And now he gets pretty big, and then we're going to attack her for eight damage. And then we'll armor up and end the turn. I hope you so now she really has to worry about dealing with these. And with those small guys, that wasn't that great move. Oh, okay, there we go. We got a fireball. That should go to him. Yep. That's okay, because now we have the win on our turn here. And just to add insult to injury, we're going to give him all a plus one, plus one. And they come to the face for the win. And that's all she wrote. Garrosh versus Garrosh. Alright, so here we go with a warrior mirror match. And I don't want I'm going second, so uh well I don't want this or this. I don't want the Gnomish Inventor. I'll keep the War Song Commander. That's actually kinda nice. Uh yeah, so we'll in our turn there, uh, not in our turn, we'll uh, switch out these guys, and that wasn't that great. It's still jewel heavy stuff. Alright, so, let's see how, oh my god, I drew into just nothing but uh, high cost stuff. Uh, Alright, well, I got no, no play here, so we'll end our turn. What you want? Oh my god, why am I just drawing this stuff? I could... Uh, do I want to coin into the Warsong Commander? No, he'll attack into it. Um, and there's really nothing else that will uh, come after it. So we will armor up for now and end our turn. Don't mess with Tusk! Um, we've just got a pretty bad start here. I could. Oh, actually, this is this is useful. I could. Uh, no. Hmm. I could coin into a yeti, which will give him some problems. But uh, coin into the shield master right now. I think that 
is probably the play. We'll coin into the shield master. We'll end a turn there. Um, then I'm thinking I can follow it up with the Warsong Commander. No, no. I, I want to have the Warsong Commander and the Shield Master out at the same time so the Shield the Commander is protected, but that's not really working out. Um, we're gonna. I can't play this yet. I uh, can you. Uh, what do I have? Three and only one. Alright, let's. I think we're just gonna do the Chilwin Yeti right now. To win Yeti and end our turn. So we, we just draw too many uh, high cost stuff early. And this guy's got a bunch of stuff out, so let's see how we're gonna deal with this. Um we got a couple heroic strikes. I can play the Storm Pike Commando. That'll take out something. We'll play the Stormpike Commando. Uh, have it do, do it's two damage to that. And I'm just gonna attack. Do I attack him directly? Or I, I need to get control of the battlefield, so we'll do I that. Attack the minion with oh, thought. that's right. Ah, uh, shit. That'll kill me. Uh, it's fine. That's we're gonna do that. I will right, we'll end the turn there. All right, we're getting into our, our mid mid game here, so actually things should improve very shortly. So we're gonna be up to six. All right, things are going to improve now. That's actually pretty nice right there. So we we have six. We will. Play a Warsong Commander. Play a Chatterton Cleric. Give him a bonus. And we will. Give that minion a Not that guy. That Not that guy. This guy right. will attack that, killing it. And we'll end our turn right there. Charge forward. Ready to ride. Uh, this guy's already got charge. Man, we are just so behind the eight ball here, but we're about to come back. I keep saying that, but it's it's about to happen. It's about to happen. All right, uh, I can do. Uh, do, 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 do. I can do a heroic. Uh, we'll put the yeti out. We'll put a heroic strike, and we'll use the heroic strike to take out. Uh, actually, we want to get rid of this guy here. And we'll end the turn there. Um, this guy's doing doing much better than me right now. Uh, but, but here's the thing. He's down to one card and I still have a bunch of stuff here. So, though I'm very low, I should be able to bring this back. It's just going to take a little bit of work here. Uh, do I want to draw or uh, you know I, I've done a lot of damage I've done to myself uh, let's see here we can uh, I'll play this uh, berserker here get rid of that guy and I think I wanna mm, we're gonna we're just gonna armor up we need to, and we'll end our turn there. What you looking at? All right, he's getting up there with his armor. Okay, this is perfect. This is what I was waiting for. So here we go. We'll definitely play this Elven yes, Archer, doing the damage to the Boulder Fist Ogre. I will execute him. He's done. And uh, let's see here. 
we will play the Stormwind Champion now. Behold Now's the time. The might of and we're going for some damage. Alright, so not a great start, but we've kind of come around to now being control of the battlefield. That's fine, you can do that heroic strike. You're gonna take some damage though. He's probably gonna go after that guy, yep. Okay, now we got, look at this, look at our setup now. And we got uh, some good stuff here. We're gonna uh, play the Gnomish Inventor, so we can draw that card. Hope we get something good. Uh, I'll hold on to that in case he plays out a weapon. So we're gonna hold on to all of these. We're gonna armor up and commence some beat down here. I'll give it a shot. And we'll end our turn. Shall so use these as control. Okay. This will this will work out. Ooh, we got a fire war axe. Uh well before I forget, uh let's armor up. I'm gonna actually attack. Yeah, I'm gonna attack with this one one. Mine dies, but then I will play the execute to remove him. I th will. I'll put the war axe, but I'm not gonna. Yeah, yeah, actually. Well, let's see here. That's four, two, two. Uh, yeah, she's really low, so we will attack. And then uh, again, I'm holding on to these, and end the turn. So unless he does something spectacular, we got the win next turn. Especially with this heroic strike. He needs taunt. Do we have ten damage? We have seven here, eight yeah, this is this is game. Alright, so we will heroic strike. And armor up because we can. And four five, six. Seven eight. And we will Right there. Blam. And that's how you come back from a bad start. Garrosh versus Anduin. The light shall bring victory. Alright, so we're facing off against a priest, so we we definitely want to play as fast as possible to keep up with his healing. So we'll we don't want that guy. We will keep these. We will definitely keep these. These are good control cards. Uh I could have I could have not held on to the heroic strike. Actually, in retrospect, I should have let that go because I usually like to use that later. Um, but I got nothing to play here, so we'll end our turn. And second turn, I can fire war axe. Oh, I got the war song commander. So we will. Um, actually, I could just armor up now. Nah, just uh, I'll fire our war axe. We wanna, we wanna be offensive, and we will attack him to the face. Against this guy, we're gonna wanna yeah see because you, you can restore two health. So we gotta we gotta just uh, press the attack as much as we can here. Um, hmm. I think I'm gonna do the War Song Commander now. Charge, charge to the face. Uh, holy smite! Oh. What does he got? Strumming it, yeah. Damn it. Uh, I was hoping it would survive. I was gonna pump it up with the cleric here, but that didn't work out. Um, so now we don't have much good stuff. We're gonna play this Gnomish Inventor. In the turn, see what we drew. Acidic uh, Swamp Boots, that'll help. Silverback Patriarch with Taunt. Alright, it's, uh, what's, it's got four health there. I can actually kill it with Heroic Strike. Yeah, we will... Because it only does one damage, so I'll Heroic Strike on myself. I will play the Shattered Sun Cleric. Do I want to do that? Is that the one I want to play? Yeah. We must Shattered Sun Cleric. Sun Give this well. plus one, plus one. We will use our attack to get rid of the taunt guy and then attack to the face. There we go. So we got rid of his minion and got some damage on him. 
puts out a raptor. And he's gonna heal himself. Alright. We gotta keep up our damage output to outpace that healing. Which we should be able to do. And actually, uh, now is a good time for the taunt. Because then these guys are safe. So we'll go to the face. And the last two. Uh, do I want to. Actually, I think I want to. I'm going to play this Acidic Swamp Ooze. I was going to armor up, but I, I, I just want to get as much offense as possible. Is someone injured? That's not great. What do we got here? Um, hmm. I think I want to get the Gnomish Inventor for the draw card. Uh, I really would like to draw into a weapon or heroic strike to get rid of this thing. We need this needs to go away. So let's put the Gnomish Inventor and see if we draw something good. That's not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted at all. So, um, I think I'm going to actually sacrifice. Oh, no, this guy will live through it. All right, we'll use this guy to attack that. Because we need to get rid of that. Um, oh, actually, I will, I will put this guy as well. And then the rest of these. So, I, I made a mistake there. I should have played... I should have played this guy. Be well, I wouldn't know because I just drew him. Yeah, so uh, uh, that worked out the way it worked out. We, we have some good offense here. All right. So now this got hurt and it got pumped up, but I have an execute for him. So we're going to silence him right now. So we will execute him because he's hurt. That kills him. Uh, we do have a shield master here that we have to kill. Uh, how do we want to do this? We will use... We'll throw this... Uh, up against that because it's dying anyway. Uh, we'll attack hey, that minute. guy, finish it off. And I think I'm going to put this other taunt guy because he will have charge. Uh, we will armor up. And then everything goes to the face. And that's the game holy crap so that's how you beat a cleric just gotta push the offense very fast well guys thanks for watching this episode of hearthstone if you like this video please give me a like rating be sure to go down in the comment section and uh, leave a comment and if you want to see more of these videos be sure to subscribe so you can see uh, all of them as i post them and be sure to check in the upper right hand corner to see the link to this and other videos that i've done so guys until my next video i'll see you soon